Hello my dear friends today we are going to discuss how to get the characteristics of a gene diode you know like a gene diode is uh, similar also with pn junction but keeping in mind it is uh, operated in the reverse bias and uh, um it works and the breakdown region so this is the reverse biasing reverse biasing which is variable which we can give to the gene diode this is a ammeter by which we which we measure current we will measure current with this uh, ammeter this is the negative of the gene diode negative of the gene diode is connected through ammeter which is connected in series so first of all n is connected uh, in line with ammeter and uh, as ammeter is coming in series then because is a negative uh, of the gene it is connected with positive supply through n ammeter on the other hand p of the gene is uh, connected uh, via resistance to limit to keep the current in limit so p is connected to resistance and uh, other terminal of the resistance is connected to the negative supply to and uh, to get the measurement of the reverse biasing how much it is applied we connect the uh, we connect the two uh, terminals of the variable voltage with the voltmeter now with this knob we we will vary the voltage of the which is applied to the gene and uh, we will measure the current so you are looking like uh, as we go on increasing the reverse biasing there is no current there is no current till current started at uh, some some high uh gene voltages like no current no current and then current started around at uh, current started at around um mm, it around when it crosses the 7 volt so you're looking now there is a current when you cross the cross the 7 volt so if uh, there are two scales in the ampere meter milliampere and microampere so you can uh, you can obtain the data the voltage versus current so in microampere the current goes out of limit once it crosses the breakdown voltage but in uh, if it is in uh, milliampere then current remains in limit So this is how we get the characteristics of the gene diode. Thank you very much.